Hello guys, I'm back with another build update. This is the media build version 4.0 and it's for um, Cody 17.6 Krypton. You can also install this on your previous previous um, Cody Krypton if you wish. But um, let me jump right into it and show you guys. Um, I'm going uh, to do a fresh install. I have the build install already, but I'm going to just do a fresh install with you guys. So the first thing you want to do, you'll navigate to your file manager. You'll go to add source. And the source you'll put in is right here. It's http colon forward slash forward slash archive dot org forward slash download forward slash Steven capital T and capital V. All right, so TV is in capital letters. All right, and then once you type that in, you click done. You could change the name if you want to. I'm gonna just leave it as um, Stephen TV, and then you hit OK. I like to before I do anything, I like to just go in there first and see if I see items in there. That means I typed it incorrectly. All right, then you'll back out and then you'll go to your add-ons. Install from zip. Scroll down to Steven TV. Then install it. Now do know it takes a takes a little bit to download. I'm gonna back out and go back into it. So you can see the progress of it. As you can see, it's currently download and add on. So just be patient. All right, mine says updated, but um, you're saying yours should say that it's installed. All right, now you back out, then you'll go to your program add-ons because it'll be in your program section, and it's right here, the Steven TV Wizard. Click on it. All right, and then you'll go to builds. And you'll scroll down, and the particular build we're installing is the media build. I'm going to just wait for the art to pop up so you'll know you're at the right place. Right here, the media build. You also have different choices here. You have the ambi build, cinema build, the simplified build. It's the recent one, the cinema max build. Alright, so we'll... Do the media build version 4.0 and click on it. All right, we're going to do a fresh install, so I'm going to just do a fresh install. Then I'm going to hit continue. All right, and then uh, dialogue should pop up. Now it's dialog um, downloading. As you can see, this build is um, 305 megabytes. So it's not ideal for a Fire Stick. Because um, that's just a download zip file size. Now do note, with any build, the download zip file is different than what the build's going to be once it's extracted. So once it's extracted, it's a little bigger. So don't think that, um, you know, when you download a build that's 250 megabytes, you think like, oh, okay, it's 250 megabytes. No. Once you download it, 
that's just, just the size because it's compressed. So after you download it and extract it, it'll be probably an extra 100 megabytes on top of the 250. A little more or less. Not sure how much more or less, but it's, it'll be more. Definitely more than 250 megabytes. And I um, also want to take the time out to thank all of you guys for leaving your comments and, um, you know, and interacting, you know, with the comments below. Just let me know what's going on and stuff like that. And um, first, I thank you guys for tuning into my channel and subscribing. I really appreciate it. I had to take my belts over to to this wizard and um because the Aries wizard is no more actually it's done it's done for so all the builds I had on there because they used to host my builds they're uh, my builds are gone those builds that's up there are gone so I had to start fresh with these builds. I'm not going to OD like I did last time with, when my builds were on Aries. One time I had 20 builds up there. I'm not doing that again. It's kind of hard to keep up. So I'm going to try to keep them in a minimum. Alright, it's almost finished downloading. And... Okay, now it's extracting. As you can see, when it's extracting, it'll equal to 482 megabytes. See, so the, the download size is not the same as when it's um, ext finished extracting. So um, you should guys should keep that in mind when you download any build, any build from anybody. The, like I said, the download size is different from after it's finished extracting. Finish installing it. it. Says, would you like to full close Cody or reload? I'll force close. I like to go into my settings and force close it this way also. And I also make sure that the ES File Explorer is not running. I'm on the NVIDIA Shield and for some reason every time the ES File Explorer is running and my Cody is running, it slows my, you know, it slows my system down for some reason. I don't know why. But anyway, back into Cody. Right, you give it a, a few to get itself together. All right, let it populate the background. Uh, let the widgets pop up. And also, I, I, um, I'm using the Indigo, in this build, I'm using the Indigo for, um, for maintenance. So the auto, the auto maintenance is set on the Indigo. I really don't like the, um, the wizard that I'm using, the Steven TV wizard. 
the um the maintenance on that. Sometimes it doesn't um delete the cache. So I decided to leave it on the indigo. But you could turn the indigo auto maintenance off if you wish. And um and um put the Steven Wizard um auto maintenance on if you want to. Alright, so let me browse around and show you guys. Here's the movie zone. It's your streams. It's your film. It's your series. It's your kids. USA TV. Live TV. Your music. Your favorites folder. Your add-ons. Your weather. Your settings. And we're back to movie. Right here we have some random movies. It changes every now and often. It doesn't stay the same, so it all always be different up here. And you could um click on a movie from here and click on gifted. And these are one click movies and they just play. And also guys keep note when a movie starts, I like to slide over to where the volume control is at, the audio control, and also look at the audio stream. Sometimes you have two different languages. All right, as you see, it's in 720. All right, I'm gonna try to find something with a different language so I could show you guys. Let's try Anna, Annabella. I know this is um, a trailer. Let's go into movies. I found one in there that has dual languages. I give it a couple of seconds for all the movies to come up. It's um, loaded with movies. It's 12,249 movies. I basically wanted this build to be more about, you know, movies and you know, media type. All right, you could change a few when you slide to the left. You could change a few from here, or you could also search for a movie down here. But first, let me show you. All right, you see three um three days to kill. So you have two options. This one should be 1080p. I was playing it earlier. And this one should be 720p. Alright, so if you see multiple ones, also you see four of them here. They're just from different sources. Alright. So you have a ton of movies here. New movies and old movies. A ton of movies. Alright, let me... See if I could find one with dual languages. I'm gonna go to 10 Cloverfield. Let me see. No, this is in English. And while I'm at it, you can also turn the subtitle off. Uh, but you get the point. Once you play it, I'll go to the audio. Click on the audio and then you scroll down. Some of the movies are in Persian. You'll see two choices, Persian or English or Persian or unknown. Just pick unknown. On the unknown one would also be English. Just click on that. The video will stutter for like a quick second and then switch to English language. Alright. In the submenu, you have action. Adventure, animation, let's go into animation. Alright, so you have some kid stuff in here also. You have uh, different Alvin and the Chipmunk movies.
It's English. But anyway, she says in 720. So just one on um, one click movies. I have comedy, drama, family, fantasy, horror, romance, science fiction, war, and western movies. Alright, so you have a ton of movies in here you could watch. Alright, here you have your streams. Alright, you have your sports up here. I'm going to click on a few to show you that they work and they're in great quality. This is in 720. Go to NFL Network. It's 540, but it looked like it's 720. You got NBA TV. Oh, pressed the wrong thing. If MLB Network, seven twenty. If NHL, golf, tennis, CBS Sports Network, Fight Network. Let's go to Fight Network. On commercial. You have WWE, FNS, no SN World, SN, um, SN360. Let's go on that one. All right, I you you have NFL. Now you have your regular channels. Now keep in mind these channels. To me, I feel like they reserved. Right, I'm going to show you later on in the video what I mean by that. Alright. Um, now you have your regular channels. So you have 343 channels. These channels, some of them is there. They're just not named. And some of them, some of them don't play. And some of them play. Alright. You have your premium channels. Alright, in the sub menu you have your sports schedule. Alright, so you have your now playing. Now, let's go to this one. Alright, see it says channel 110. But when you seen the blank channels, those earlier when I showed you the whole list, this is one of the channels. So if the whatever's playing at that time, it'll be in there. Let me go to all today's event. Let's say you want to watch this later when you click on it. It says 134. It's not playing now, but once it's playing, it'll, it'll it'll be here. All right, let's back up out of there. You have your USA, UK streams. You have a whole bunch of channels here also. Takes a couple of seconds to load up on some of the channels. So that one is not functioning, I guess. But you have a good lot of channels in here.
but the channels to go to is the, um, the stream section. All right, so like I said, you have a lot of channels in here. You also have your sports channels in here. Let's try one more. So you have TBS and TBS HD. All right, let's back up out of there. You have Skynet, IPTV, Survivor. TV. Let's go to Survivor TV. You have your movie channel, sports, news, Latino, kids, and music. Let's go to movie channels. Let's go to HBO. Now, I explained this in one of my videos. Let's stop it. Sometimes you get a dialogue that pops up like so. All you, all you gotta do is just hit cancel. It's annoying, but I don't know. The, the, the streams were great for me. So that's the only annoyance with this particular add on. It pops up again, just hit cancel. All right, so you have your movie channels there. You have your TV one. RSIP TV and Made in Canada. Here you have your film. Now this is from the Poseidon add-on. I, I love this add-on. It's my go-to add-on for movies and TV shows. It's working pretty good. It's working real good. I get a lot of HD links. A lot of 1080p or 720p links. To me is one of the best add-ons that's out there. So the link I'm I usually use, I don't use sometimes I use the DL file, but it's kind of slow. I use this one right here, direct link, what's it called? My download tube. And this is in 1080p. Let me show you real quick. As you see on the top, it's in 1080. All right, I love this add-on. It it's where it works wonders for me. All right, when you click on films, it takes you to the Poseidon um movie section. All right, in the sub menu you have Adam, Triton, Fork, Survivor. Maverick movies, Rebirth, you have quite a few here. You even have Strictly HD, Skynet movies. Here you have your series. All right, um, what played yesterday? I believe it was, no, it wasn't The Flash. I just want to show you guys. Uh, I was Supergirl. All right, season three. Let me just change the view. I like to see the dates. All right. All right, so this was aired yesterday on the 20th. I'm going to click on that. All right, now for TV shows, or if I see the link in the movies, I use that also. I use this one right here, Hast HD. I haven't tried these other ones, but I use Hast HD. It's in 720p. And it's the latest episode. 
Usually the latest episode be crap. You know, that year there's no, really no links out for them yet, but this add-on works wonders for me. I'm going to go to Gifted. Oh, it's not Gifted. The Good Doctor. Excuse me. Uh, let me change the view again. This one aired yesterday. All right, here we go. Has the HD. As you see on the top, it's in 720. All right. And you also have your options in the sub menu down here. Your fork, Adam Covenant. All right, you also have the Survivor, Triton, Maverick TV box sets. I forgot to show you in here when you click on series. It takes you to the TV show section of the Poseidon add-on. It's a great add-on. Here you have your kids section. Trying to find more kids where you get a lot of 720p or 1080p movies and, you know, stuff for kids. I really don't like the 480p quality all right and down here you have your family so you have some family movies in here here you have USA TV I'm gonna just go down one by one. It's ABC HD. Back up out of that. AMC. Back up out of that. Go to Bravo. No, Bravo, no good. Go to CBS HD. Uh. CW oh. There's another CW at the bottom I ran across it earlier There's another one on the bottom And another HD HGTV As you see that's two links Let's Try TBS SD Uh, TBS HD is working. So you have a lot of channels. Let's try AFN Sports. You have to be in Sports USA, Cinemax. The Fox HD. You have Star Spikes, Nickelodeon, Showtime. It goes on all the Bravo. I believe the first one wasn't working. This one works, but it says Nicktoons. Some of the channels are mixed up. Here's another CW. And this is CW. I see it on the bottom right. Kind of faint, but this is CW. It's another CW right there. You have ESPN, Fox Sports. 
HGTV. MSG, you have a lot of channels in here. All right, here you have live TV. And these are your news channels. You also have some sports news right here. You have NFL Now, MLB, WWE. Let's try Pack 12. Is this Los Angeles? I want to give it a couple of seconds to load. If you have your own IPTV service, and um, you know, for the PVR, you can set that up, and it'll be right here. All right, let's click on Live TV itself. Slide to the. No, hit the back button, and then go to all channels. You also have your music choice radio. All right, you have hip hop and R and B hit list. Metal, pop country, pop hits, R&B and soul. Let's go to R&B and soul. It's it's playing. All right, it's back up out of there. You have your music section. Here you have your music videos. Click on pink. No video stream found. Okay, YouTube. Hmm. Probably have to update my YouTube. Anywho, you have your music video there. Here's your, when you click on music, you have your Django music. And here in the bottom, you have your music box. Okay, so you have your different options in here. In your music box. Your favorites folder. I have only added these two just to show you guys. If you have a TV show, so instead of adding it to your library, because there's a lot of movies in there, so it'll take a while to scan. It'll scan the movies first before... It's going to scan 12,000 and something movies first before it's going to scan the TV show. So I suggest... Adding your TV shows to your favorites folder. All right, add to favorites. Here's your add-ons where you can find all add-ons, picture add-ons, program add-ons, music add-ons, and your video add-ons. All right, it's not a lot of add-ons in here because you know add-ons go up and down. So you know I try to find different ways to. To get content. Alright. Here you have your weather. Let's click on weather. When you slide to the left. You could go to settings. And then go to settings. Location. I'm going to just change it. 11208. And hit done. I'm in New York. So I'm going to click New York. Slide over to the right and then hit OK. All right. So once, oh, it changed already. As you can see right there, it says 11208. Sometimes you have to wait till Cody refreshes itself or when you exit Cody and go back into Cody, it changes. All right here's your settings. Under settings, you'll find the Steven TV Wizard, the Indigo, the File Manager, Update Video. I update my videos. I mean, every two days or so or whatever. This updates the movies that's in the movie zone. If there's a movie, a new, a couple of new movies added, it'll be there. So what I do is before I go to sleep or whatever, I just hit update. I go to my home screen and put my device to sleep. My shield, yeah, I put my, my shield TV to sleep. And when I wake up, it's done. All right, here's your quit button, your files. All right, the files. Here's you can add more streams. All right, these are the streams that I put here that pulls the movies. Some of them is activated, some of them is not. The TV shows is not active. All right, if you want to add the TV shows, you can. You just hit your context button. 
and scroll down you set content click on where it says this directory contains you select TV show you hit OK it says do you want to refresh information for all items within this pass you would click yes alright I'm not gonna do that now cuz it's it's gonna matter of fact yeah I'm gonna do that now add these TV shows alright let it do what it do and it's gonna start adding the TV shows I'm trying to find more links for TV shows alright see so now it's scanning the TV shows All right, and you can see TV shows popped up right here with the widget. So more TV shows that's being added right now, it'll pop up right there. All right, and you also have your categories right here on the bottom. Let's go to action. Once it's finished adding more TV shows, then I guess it, you could use it. What is this, drama? Yeah, this TV show is drama. Alias Grace. Alright, so here you have it. The Media Bill version 4.0. Thank you guys for watching. If you're new to my channels, hit that subscribe button. And I'll talk to you guys soon.